Hi, this is Dale from vhorizon.co.uk and today we're going to be installing a security server and connecting it to our existing connection servers. So the first thing we need to do is we need to log into an existing connection server and specify a pairing password. So I'm just going to log into connection server. Okay, so we're at our servers node here. Then we need to click on the connection servers. Then click on the connection server that we'd like to pair with the security server. And then click right click that and then select specify security server pairing password. The password can be set to expire after a certain number of minutes, but we're going to leave it at the default 30. And click OK. OK, so now that's set, we need to switch back to our virtual machine that's going to be the new security server. And here's one I prepared earlier. So again, we've got that same connection server package on the desktop ready to be deployed. So I'm just going to run the installer. Okay, and when the wizard starts, just hit next, agree to the license, and click next. And the default location for installation is fine. And then from this list, we choose View Security Server. So the installation is asking for the details of the connection server that we specified the security pairing password. So I'm just going to put in the IP address of that virtual machine. So now it's asking for the password. I'm just going to enter in the pairing password we entered earlier. Okay, I'm just going to click OK to this. Okay, so these details are basically what the external URL of the security server is going to be, uh, or your deployment. So if you have, for example, uh, view.vhorizon.co.uk, you'd enter those details in here. Now this is configurable later on within the view administrator, so at the moment I'm not too worried about these settings. So I'll explain a little bit more about these in another blog post. And again, I'm going to leave the defaults for Windows Firewall. And again, install location is fine. Okay, so the installation is now complete. Again, we'll untick the show readme and click finish. So now, if I navigate back to my view administrator console, there we have our security server listed under the security servers tab. Okay, so that's it for the basic installation. So thank you for watching. If you require more details, please visit vhorizon.code.uk. Thank you.